Hellos, so welcome to the hashtag Blue Mike, a great show where you know, जहाँ हम बहुत सारे ऐसे independent artists को आपके साथ introduce करते हैं। हर हफ्ते हम आपके साथ कोई ना कोई ऐसे लोगों को introduce करते हैं जो अपने आप में great मुकाम हासिल कर चुके हैं। But but but, आज जो मेरे साथ हैं, I will have to give no introduction. These guys are very famous. You guys have been hearing them. और जिसने अपनी diary के पन्नों में कुछ भी लिखा है, वो इसके नाम के साथ में जुड़ सकता है, because these are the guys, the yellow diary. Hello, G. And Hello. Welcome Hello. to the show. Hello. Hashtag Blue Thank Bike. Thank you for having us. Thank you for having us. You most welcome. And this is going to be the fan moment because I've been hearing your songs and they are beautiful out there. So Thank would you. you love to introduce yourself so that everyone can know कि कौन कौन हमारे साथ जुड़ा हुआ है आज? Sure. My name is Himanshu. I play keys and I'm the music producer for the band. I am Rajan and I'm the vocalist and the songwriter. Hi, I'm Sahil. I play the drums in the band. I'm Stuart. I play bass. I'm Raj. I play the guitar. And Monday blues. एक सबसे important चीज होती है ज़िंदगी में हमारे. What do you guys do to take over these Monday blues? Honestly, I feel like the the beauty of doing what you love every day for us is like we wake up without Monday blues. Because uh, it's just a joy to make music, and we living the life that we're living. We honestly feel pretty blessed. So, I guess mm-hmm. yeah, no Monday blues over here. So be that one song which connects you all guys together, like you know that first song and the first memory of the songs, which is say ki yeah, ye wo pal tha jahan hum ek saath mile, ek saath jude, aur hume laga ki this is the right way that you know the band has to go and get started. What was that song, babe? I think it wasn't it wasn't that one song, or it wasn't that one moment. Uh, बहुत सारे मोमेंट्स का कल्मिनेशन था टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट वी रिक्वायर मूविंग फॉरवर्ड एंड हु डू वी वांट टू एसोसिएट विद और हु डू वी थिंक इज गोइंग टू फिट द बैंड और द द आउटफिट वेल एंड इट्स इट्स इन फैक्ट अ वेरी ब्यूटीफुल जर्नी इन इटसेल्फ यू नो टू बी एबल टू काइंड ऑफ फिगर आउट हु यू वुड वांट टू गेट इनटू अ पार्टनरशिप लाइक दिस विद एंड हु डू यू रियली रिक्वायर यू नो इन अ सर्टेन सेंस आई थिंक आई थिंक मार्स बो No, but we uh, often say, uh, like, we often also say this to people that uh, Mars is not the, a song the band made, but uh, Mars the song that made the band. You know, because it's a, it's it's the song that connected all of us uh, to each other. It's the song that connected us uh, to our listeners, uh, to the label, and I think it's something that started the journey for us. So. It it ties into what Rajan was saying really beautifully that Mars always was like the underlying foundation where the journey 100%. began from. Yeah. Also, it, it must be said that now uh, uh, we we kind of up, uh, changed our guitar player who was the original uh, fourth fifth member called Weber Fani, and now, and now we, we have, have... Uh, Harshvardhan Gadvi on guitars. What point is that? Ma. The essay, sub say, sub say, che. The only <laughs> man who's wearing glaze actually and showing off. तो अगर एक टीचर की तरह पूछा जाए कि हर छात्र फिलहाल जो यहाँ बैठा है वो ये बताए कि उसकी जिंदगी में संगीत के क्या मायने हैं तो भाई. आप क्या क्या कहेंगे म्यूजिक इज लाइक अ व्हीकल फॉर मी वन वेयर यू गेट टू पुट ऑल योर इमोशंस योर थॉट्स व्हाट योर फीलिंग इन द मोमेंट यू पुट इन दैट व्हीकल एंड देन यू जस्ट लेट इट गो वाह वाह इसके बाद अभी क्या बोले Ragnar. I mean, my thoughts also are same as these guys. Like for me, uh, <laughs> I resonate with them. Guys, y'all spoke so well. I think I'm just gonna ride off that. Uh, like even I don't know anything else in my life uh, except uh, drumming. So uh, I'm glad to be a part of this, and that's that's uh, that's what it means to me. It's it's a part of me. It's it's like my arm. Like how how we have hands and legs. That's how drumming is to me. So, it's a limb. Yeah, yeah, it's a limb. It's like a release, like a mental release, you know, for all the thoughts and all the observations and whatever that's experiences and stuff that keep like coming into my life. And uh, for me, it becomes like a, like a, like a way I kind of release all of that on paper, and then that's that's what music does to me. So I think in a way it becomes the result of everything else, mm-hmm. and I think that's a very important thing mm-hmm. to me. For me, I feel like. Uh, gives me purpose uh, i feel like it gives me a reason uh, to be around because there's so many things you can choose in life and i feel like i chose music and music chose me and it's something i'm going to give my entire life to so it really gives me purpose 
क्या बात है यार दिस इज क्वाइट अमेजिंग मतलब किसी इंसान के हाथ पैर से लेकर किसी की गाड़ी चलती है तो किसी को अपने आप को खोने का मौका मिलता है दिस इज अ वंडरफुल एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ म्यूजिक व्हिच यू कैन एक्चुअली हैव टू बी अवेयर बट अगर इट्स इट्स इमेंस इन फैक्ट सो लेकिन हम जब कहते हैं ना कि हर एक म्यूजिक में उसके एक सोल छिपे होते हैं देयर इज देयर इज ऑलवेज समथिंग व्हिच स्पीक्स टू यू व्हिच कनेक्ट्स टू यू विद द पीपल अराउंड जब हम बात द येलो डायरी की करते हैं How do they find the soul to the music, and what is that which you feel that you know? हमारे गानों में ये खास है, इसलिए हम इतने लोगों से जुड़ जाते हैं या लोग आप से जुड़ जाते हैं. How would you like to tell and define about that? I think we don't categorize our music in a certain way. We don't, we don't, we don't put it into titles. Uh, music mm-hmm. for all of us, it's it's a culmination. What we make is a culmination of our own languages. So ultimately, we're all expressing, and our expression kind of comes together. to form a certain product and that's what people are listening and um such would we've been blessed with really good listeners and followers who really appreciate the kind of stuff we put out um but ultimately i think it's it's more a product of like self expression mm-hmm. than any of the other materialistic ideas about how like the data works or how what people would like to listen or anything else uh गानों के बारे में जब हम बात करते हाउ डू यू गाइज मेकअप इज इट लाइक किसी एक का ख्याल है कि रात को अचानक से उठ के आता है यू आर लाइक यू पिकअप द कॉल एंड सी लाइक यू नो हे गाइज आई जस्ट गॉट दिस काइंड ऑफ ट्यून इन टू माई माइंड आई हैव टू गेट सम वर्ड्स ऑन इट और इज इट लाइक यू नो अ कलेक्टिव एफर्ट विच कम्स डाउन की यार नहीं इस सिचुएशन पे गाना बनाना है तो अब सोचते क्या करना है इसको कैसे फ्रेम करना है सो हाउ डज इट ऑल वर्क विद यू आई थिंक किस सिचुएशन पे गाना बनाना है इज एन आफ्टर थॉट पहले हम यूजली यही होता है कि and there's no fixed source of where the songs will come from sometimes he plays a groove and then and that becomes a song because that kind of you know given i give birth to an idea or he plays something on the bass or he plays something on the guitar or he's mostly he's mm-hmm. on the piano and then we are uh in the room and writing all together uh but it's a no matter where the source comes from ultimately songwriting as a process for us is more like a of layering the idea with other ideas to make it like a bigger picture to wo source kuch bhi ho sakta hai chahe iska ek riff hai ya mere dimag mein koi vocal melody aa gaya ya isne kuch baja diya but ultimately the goal of writing becomes more of a uh, complementing what we the idea that we have with other ideas and then and then we form a song to isi baat pe aap logo ka gana bhi ho jaye which is that one song that you would like to sing for all the listeners for us so there is this song that we are releasing soon um the song is yes. uh, called mujhe mere naam se and it is about it is for the dreamers it's, it's about people who dream and then go on to achieve those deals or uh, those dreams and uh, and i feel like everybody has a journey and everybody's journey is individual and everybody has a dream that they kind of move towards uh so the song goes like mujhe mere naam se jaan lo main hath na unga हवा बन जाऊंगा उस तस्वीरों में भर लो तुम मैं आज बन जाऊंगा फिर शायद ही आऊंगा उस जहा क्या बात है नाउ वुड यू सी सक्सेस एज गाइड लाइक यू नो Success has its own meanings to everybody. What does success means to you all? Success, I think, in a very artistic point of view, would be uh, when people start to resonate with your with your art. And uh, we played a gig mm-hmm. in Delhi yesterday, and uh, I think almost everybody kind of sang sang our songs back to us. And I think there is no better reflection of success than that. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, I feel like. success is also like you said it's very relative but i feel like it's contentment you know and feeling a sense of fulfillment in what you do and like if you are able to just enjoy what you do and enjoy your life while you're doing it i think it's success and and stuart is nodding the head you know on that point that yeah that's very true totally true stuart you would like to add on something to it <laughs> <laughs> in hindi no no, no. अगर अगर हम आपसे कहें कि आप उसे शुद्ध हिंदी में हमें बताएं कि आपकी ही क्या है 
success is so many metrics you know i feel like uh, today what we find that that is our metric of reaching somewhere as a goal tomorrow is going to be our baseline success is something which actually keeps evolving the time as you evolve as a person in fact individually so uh, this been a moment in your life guys where you thought that up music nahi ho sakega yaar matlab this is not what we really wanted to do and that was the lowest time of your life and then you just got back and said that no we are meant for music and we are going to be back again of what we are we as a phase work kis zindagi mein i think not as a collective we yeah. never reached a point where we felt like okay ab nahi ho payega Uh, because i think uh, the best thing about us is that we kind of also motivate and inspire each other in some way or the other so even if somebody if one person is feeling low or feeling a certain way about things there are other four people you know to get him back on track to, to make him feel better and uh, i think that's also one of the biggest strengths that we have as a group that we really care for each other we're a family and uh, as a family we take care of the fact that everybody is hoping to move forward in the best way possible and feeling constantly inspired absolutely yeah. so what relationship advice to what you actually give to all the other members of the guys saying that i have gone through this ye mat karna bhai bas communication is key and uh, that's what relationships are built on healthy communication and i mean it's it's, it's really it's uh, it's also amazing because just talking about relationships in general communication is so important and for us as well when covid hit like in 2020 and we all were in our own homes we had to communicate constantly you know be it through the phone or whatever and then rose rose happened at one of our songs and rose rose itself also talks about communication and that song was literally made remotely through us just communicating with each other so i feel like communication is is okay. powerful too yeah to kyun na wo gana ek bar ho jaye yeah you rose rose rate आखें क्यों चुराते हैं हम मुझे लगे जैसे खुद को ही छुपाते हैं रोज रोज रोते हो आखें क्यों चुराते हो हम मुझे लगे जैसे खुद को ही छुपाते हो ऐसा क्या भला मन में खर रहा गुनगुनाना शुरू किया तो बाकी के तीनों मेंबर्स ने अपने अपने हाथ हिलाने शुरू कर दी की कोई ना कोई धुन उनके दिमाग में भी चल रही थी तो आप लोगों की जिंदगी का अगर मैं पूछू कोई ऐसा धुन बदल देने वाला मोमेंट रहा हो वट वु जब हम बैंड जब हम हाँ जब हम नए नए बैंड बने थे और हम लोगों को बता रहे थे कि म्यूजिक वे मेकिंग आई थिंक तब हमारा जो गिटारिस्ट थे वैभव पानी ही ट्वीटेड आउट ऑफ टू अ लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल एंड हमने एक्सपेक्ट नहीं किया था बट लॉर्ड ऑफ रियली गुड म्यूजिशन रियली रिस्पेक्टेड आर्टिस्ट काइंड ऑफ रिवर्ड बैक टू अस आई थिंक दैट वॉज really a moment where we kind of felt like we are on the right direction you know that validation kind of is very important so i think that was one of those moments when when things really changed for us in a certain way kya baat hai amazing to jab aapne baat ki hai ki aapke un dinon ki to main bhi bata dun ki hamare sath bhi ek artist jud chuke hain he's also an independent artist and we would love to introduce him to you guys so ishan are you there with us hi So, Ishan, हम चाहेंगे कि आप अपना इंट्रोडक्शन एक बार हम सभी को एक बार बता दें कि आप कौन है आपने कितने गाने गुनगुनाए हैं और आप किस जॉनर में गाना गुनगुनाना पसंद करते हैं सो दैट वी कैन नो समथिंग मोर अबाउट यू श्योर सो माय नेम इज ईशान निगम एंड आई एम अ सिंगर सॉन्ग राइटर एंड डिपेंडेंट आर्टिस्ट सो आई रिसेंटली मूव टू मुंबई एंड आई हैव बीन रिलीजिंग माय सिंगल्स सिंस 2019 एंड आई हैव रिलीज्ड कपल ऑफ सिंगल्स लाइक देयर आर 10 सॉन्ग्स एज ऑफ नाउ व्हिच आई हैव रिलीज्ड एज सिंगल्स uh apart from that uh, uh i'm i've also done uh, my masters in indian classical music and uh i've recently done one of the debut uh, for one of the films which have been uh, released on hotstar which is called fir oh, nice. and uh, congratulations uh, thank you so yeah uh yahi sab abhi chal raha hai and uh, <laughs> great great fan of uh, uh, the yellow diaries and uh, i want you like literally love your work man thank you so much man thank you 
क्या बात है तो फैन कॉमिक तो यहाँ पे भी बनने वाला है तो इशान कोई ऐसा एक गाना जो आप हमें सुनाना चाहेंगे एंड यू नो दी येलो जारी कैन ऑल्सो हियर इट अक्रॉस विद अस फॉर श्योर सो आई बी सिंगिंग वन ऑफ माय सॉन्ग्स व्हिच हैज बीन रिटन एंड कंपोज्ड बाय अ वेरी डियर फ्रेंड सो वी बेसिकली वर्क एज अ डुओ हिज नेम इज ब्राइट रॉय एंड दिस सॉन्ग इज कॉल्ड ओ चांद से Thank you so much. I think any kind of a uh, question which comes to your mind when you are meeting these guys from the Yellow Diary. Yeah. So, uh, like, I have a couple of questions. Being an independent artist, you know, because as an independent artist, it is literally hard to survive in an industry. And plus, if you want to, you know, uh, go into playback and stuff, or do want to do up film stuff. So, uh, like, I know Himanshu has been one of my, you know. is one of the artists whom i always look up to we sometimes talk as well so uh, uh like you know uh, i have question that as an independent artist how one should uh, you know craft uh, you know, not craft but how one should shape their career like because uh, i believe that independent music is something which gives you a freedom to you know explore all the possible dimensions of music right there is no uh, restriction that you can't make such kind of music or you can't use such kind of sound or chords anything like that yeah. so uh, like how difficult is it to you know get accepted because uh, like as an artist you want you like your goal is not to get accepted by every but everyone but you know like because you guys have a sound right you guys have a particular style of music uh, and there is a niche audience for it right so how one should uh you know keep it simple uh, like you know i feel like uh, one of the most important things is uh the why you're making music the intention behind your music is keeping that pure and trying to stay as original as you can always 
which is going to help you like stick out basically because uh, if you tend to follow too many trends or you know do what's like everyone's kind of doing it's very easy because there's so many musicians there's so much happening but people want to listen to you because you are bringing something new to the table you know so i feel like very important to find your own sound something that you really resonate with you know something which you feel is uniquely like an ishan nigam song besides your voice and melody you know even the sound all the aspects of it and then it's also up to be very open and receptive to like what people have to say about your music and also keep trying to constantly learn and grow and change what you are doing constantly you know so i mean if you find something that works you shouldn't like necessarily stick to it always like you should kind of keep trying to evolve you know so evolving growth learning and also originality i think is are the best ways to shape your career thank you that like that was literally helpful that's interesting ishan thank you so much for joining with us and it was thank great to meet you and we'll get to have more songs from you coming up or just tarike se aap behtareen gana bana rahe hain i suppose even the yellow diary is going to be actually soon meeting you up with after this conversation thank you thank you so much <laughs> and now thank we have you. yes obviously the yellow diary back with us guys itne sare gaane aap logon ne banaye hain gungunaye hain ab aap hi ke gaano ka ek medley hona zaruri hai you know which is that song which you would love to sing one behind the other the one song that we uh, would love to uh... close this with would be uh, a song called hordasta i think uh, ah. it's, one of, it's one of the songs that whenever we come down in delhi people uh, really really want us to perform and it goes like give him mukde to nazra hatava give him mukde to nazra hatava main tere jaya hordasta थैंक यू I tell you, you must have sung this song a number of times. People love this song, but it's not perfect situation. Me, that if someone is singing this song, I will never be able to sing it. Can I get a bet on that? It's such a good song. In fact, you know, I, I take all the compliments of the song which is coming forward. So, any message that you would love to give to all our listeners who are going to be hearing you after this conversation? Yeah, I think any message that I would love to give to all our listeners who are going to be hearing you out and going to be missing up on you know that or more to know than me. So, but okay, today is enough to know. What would you love to, to tell to them? to know us more uh hit us up on our uh, social media uh we're always present um instagram facebook uh, youtube whatever you you can find us and i think uh to know us even more you should definitely check out our music it's all of our hearts right in there and uh we always are open to listening to what people feel and think about uh the kind of music we make and it's always awesome to to see the people are you know kind of conversing with us one of our songs is actually going to be showing up in a film very soon and uh, it's a film that's going to be coming on amazon prime uh, it's a film called majama and uh, it's one of our very dear songs called buniyad and that's going to be coming in that film very soon so we're like super pumped about that so everyone should like look out for that kya baat hai to koi ek aisa gana bhi hai jo aap log hi sabse alag andaaz mein gaate hain maybe it's not your song But any any of the songs which you guys actually have your own version of it. I think I think Hordasta was that one song that we tried, yeah. and then after that one song we also got kind of scared because it's not always that you can take somebody else's song and make a good version. <laughs> and mm-hmm. uh, we got mm-hmm. lucky once. We don't want to keep testing our luck much. <laughs> That is true. So this has been a beautiful show with you guys, and I'm sure that you guys' music is very much connected with each other because your language is very simple. Hai. And you know, the simpler you are, it reaches out to more people. And I really had a fun, you know, being with you guys on this show, which is hashtag the Blue Mike. And here, we celebrate more independent artists. We celebrate more independent artists because you guys are just like independent people making music. Banate, so we look up to the artists, and we know that there is actual music coming and reaching out to us. So thank you so much for being with us. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. It's been a pleasure. A pleasure.